Okay, well, we're going to go ahead and go to this. Uh, we're in a search and rescue division, and we have an airplane crash. You can hear the explosions going on right now. It's a loud one. And you're going to probably hear another one. Three, two, one, zero. Hey fellow officers, welcome back to the channel. This is Benzo. We're going to get started with some more GTA 5 police mod. We're going to be in a special park ranger division today called Search and Rescue. And we'll be uh, actually looking for missing persons as well as possible debris on the road that's causing uh, some people to uh, you know, more of a dangerous driving type of uh, issues. And we may even have some illegal hunting for some of the wildlife that we have out here but I hope you enjoy this episode we'll be rolling out with some uh, wilderness call outs and this really nice F-150 Raptor and you can tell it's uh, Los Santos County Sheriff's Search and Rescue Division it turned out really good I like this and we're gonna go ahead and get started with today's episode I'll let you take a peek on the inside just so you can see looks pretty good I like it all right. Once again, the SAR stands for Search and Rescue on the top of the, uh, the actual roof there. We have a roadway block in oh, that truck right uh, here. Grande Sonora Desert units respond code two. Well, that's easy. Looks like we're already here. Yeah, we have some. Uh, some rocks that are blocking the roadway here so let's go ahead and shut down the whole area right here I'm trying to get it out of the way just a little bit so that uh, the person can come in here let me go ahead and just call for a truck okay the trucks in route here he comes and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and shut this area or open the area rather and then he's gonna come and uh, Remove some of these tru this uh, rocks here. You can see we got some boulders and stuff, and he'll remove these boulders, and then we'll uh, let traffic so continue. Attention, all units. We are code four. No further units required. Code four ten eight. Copy that ten four. Okay, and uh, so we'll be doing things like that. It's more kind of like duty work, if you will. It's not going to be uh, terribly exciting with a lot of shootouts and things. So if you're expecting that, then uh, you'll have to wait for my next episode, I guess, right? I like to have a little bit of variety in the channel. hope you appreciate that with different plugins, different divisions. Keeps it fresh. Okay, we have a uh, animal attack out here, and uh, I'm in a bad spot right now. Let's see if I can get over here. Can this raptor do it? Can the raptor do it? Yes, it can. Need some horsepower. Here we go. Whoa. Hey, that's pretty good. All right, uh, unfortunately, we may not be able to make it in time, but we're going to try our best to get down to this animal attack. It's out of here on the main road. More than likely, we have a mountain line. We have a lot of mountain lines out here. And, uh, yeah, I was afraid of that. The person died. It looks like he's hugging the mountain lion. He's like, thank you, mountain lion. I appreciate you eating me. <laughs> I will lay down and go to sleep with you. <laughs> Look at him. He's got his arm around the mountain lion. 
Okay, we gotta do two things. First of all, let's block off traffic. Requesting paramedic. We've got a medical emergency in Vinewood Hills. Okay, we're also going to call in uh, Animal Rescue. Not that I really care about this mountain lion particularly, just because I just killed it. But uh, we need to see if we can get some people in here to help out. Okay, we'll see if we can... Uh, We'll slow some people down a little bit so they're not so uh, rambunctious here. Okay. Well, we're going to let uh, paramedics come in here and uh, see if they can rescue that person there. We'll be on our way. Yeah, the animal's dead. We have animal killed by person in Vinewood Hill. Units respond code 2. Okay, we have some uh, illegal hunting going on down here. And we're going to go code 2 with just some lights just so we can actually get down to this area a little bit better. And it looks like they're actually going to be on the main highway. Well, actually, not the highway, but one of the... Come on, man. You see lights and pull over? How dare you? Okay, let's see here. It looks like uh, that person out here looks like they tagged themselves a uh, a deer. Looks like yeah, nice. Oh man, come on. Okay, we're just gonna shut this whole thing down. We're gonna talk to this guy that just pumped this uh, buck with a pump shotty right here. We talk to this guy. How's it going? How's it going, man? Let me see your hunting license, please. Uh, yes, I actually do need to see your hunting license. Get out of there. Get down. You'll sit there and kill a buck in the middle of the road, and then you try to run. Okay, we can. A he's actually under arrest for this. He's not allowed to do this. First of all, he's too close to the roadway. Here, you come with me. You get back over here. Okay, we're going to go ahead and pat him down, search him a little bit. Forgive the animation here. Requesting transport. We have backup needed in Vinewood Hills. Attention all units, backup required, and AC. In Grande Sonora Desert, code 99, all units respond. Okay, well, we're going to go ahead and go to this. Uh, we're in a search and rescue division, and we have an airplane crash. You can hear the explosions going on right now. It's a loud one. And you're going to probably hear another one. Three, two, one, zero. Ooh. That was pretty loud. Okay, we're going to go ahead and call in some fire service. An ambulance call in Grande Sonora Desert. All units respond. Requesting EMS. Roger, dispatch. We are en route. Okay, we're going to see if we can help anybody here. No, we had an aircraft that... There's a pilot right there. I don't know if we can find anybody else that may be out here. Here comes the fire trucks. Okay, they're all pretty much going to take over here. Okay. Alright. We're going to let them take care of that. And that's a, um, it's a pretty big uh, emergency scene going on right here. So we'll let the uh, emergency medical services handle that. And then we'll be on our way. That's a pretty loud explosion. A lot of wildlife out here. 
Attention all units. We are code four. No further units required. Code four ten eight. Ten four, copy that. Attention all units. We've got a suspect resisting arrest in Vinewood Hills. And we're going to get back over here and kind of wait for another call for our division here. And I uh, hope you appreciate some of the editing that I have to do, guys. Uh, you know, obviously, we're in a search and rescue type division, so we can't be taking pursuit calls. And uh, I always make sure that I attend to my episodes pretty good. So hopefully the uh, editing comes out pretty smooth for you guys. Okay, we have an animal attack going on right over this hill, and I don't know if I can get there in time. But it looks like maybe a mountain lion or something is uh, having a free lunch right over this ridge. Don't even think about it, buddy. Sorry, I had to. Code four. No further units required. Okay. Requesting paramedic. We have an ambulance call in Vinewood Hills. Okay, we're gonna once again we're gonna go ahead and get uh, animal rescue here. You know, since we're pretty far up in the in the actual mountains, let's go ahead and do this. Let's get a uh, air ambulance in for him, we have since it's uh, pretty much em in emergent. Because not only did he uh, get eaten by that mountain lion, but some idiot tried to hit him. So, we'll let. Uh, Let her take care of that mountain line, and then, then we have the care flight coming in right above us. Some states call them life flight. You can see them right over my head right there. They're going to repel down and see if they can take care of that guy right there. And they're going to take him in that care flight, and we're going to go ahead and be on our way. Hopefully he's going to be alright. More than likely, uh, he's probably not going to be alright. And we'll hang back over here until we get another call for uh, search and rescue. Got another animal attack up here. And we're going to cut through again. We're going to go ahead and go to code 3. There's a lot of mountain lions up here. It doesn't really look like it's actually, uh, you know, attacking anybody yet, but uh, now actually now it looks like they are. And unfortunately I can't get there fast enough. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go through this fence. Actually it looks like we have a person maybe running towards us. Yep. Okay, he's running right there. We've got a... Possibly another mountain line right out here. Really? Are you, are you feeling that brave? Attention all 
units. We are code four. No further units required. Yeah, well, it wasn't coming to give me a big kiss, okay? Alright, so once again, we're gonna do animal rescue and get this uh, dead carcass off the road here. <laughs> Okay, here comes uh, Animal Rescue right behind us here. And they'll attend to that animal. At least we saved the other guy, you know. Units reporting a possible 148 in Bay Tree Canyon. We'll head up in this way. We get a lot of uh, sometimes missing persons up through here. We have reports of animal cruelty in. Fine with no units respond code two. Okay, we have uh, some more illegal hunting going on up here. And we're gonna cut through up here. And once again, here's the big billboard for Vinewood Hills. Or Vinewood, I should say. And the person down there that's uh, doing some illegal hunting is going to be on this road right down here. You can see his truck right there. Whoa. Let's see how well this raptor goes. No, no. Oh, well, that's not bad. I did good. We got him. Come on, man. What are you doing? Let's see your hunting license, your man. Mom. What's going on? Where's your hunting license at? Even? I don't think so, man. What the fuck? Get out of there. Oh. Ah. Me. You point that at me, I swear I'm going to. You better drop that sniper rifle. Suspect detained, Marlow Drive. Ten four, copy that. Okay, I'm gonna look, go ahead and do a little quick pet search on him. All right, you get over here, sir. Requesting transport. We have backup needed in Vinewood Hills. Get that animal off the road. Good day. I'm gonna search his vehicle real fast. All units. We're close four. No further units required. Requesting tow truck. We have backup needed in Vinewood Hills. Damn you! What the? <laughs> Did you hear that? He knocked out the hog from the back of. <laughs> oh man, I thought I'd seen everything. That's funny. We've got an SOS call in Mount Chiliad. Units respond code two. Okay, we're going to go ahead and turn back around. This is what we've been uh, kind of looking for right here. We've got a SOS call from uh, a party that's got a missing person. And we're going to go ahead and attempt to find them. And we're probably going to have to do a little bit of uh, off-roading here in just a moment. Or we may just follow the, the road around. We're going to attempt to try to find this missing person out here in the actual hills. Let's see if we can uh, locate them. And we should get like a uh, kind of a GPS type signal strength here in just a moment when we get a little closer. Dispatch Shelby had not seen Mount Chiliad. Okay, we're going to be looking for this person here, and we're going to go up into the uh, the terrain here, see if we can locate them. 
Out of the way, bunnies. Okay, now we're going to see if we get a good signal strength here. Okay, well, by blind luck, we actually found the person. We usually get a little signal strength uh, with the GPS. But we actually found the person here. They're right here. Let me go out and talk to this young lady. Pretty sure this is the person. Yeah, they look a little... Uh, I'm asking if she's lost and she, if she needs any assistance. She said, yes, I was with my friends having a few whiskey bottles and I fell asleep. And she woke up and she's, she was here and she doesn't know where she's at. So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and see if we can go ahead and call in an we air ambulance for her. Even though, technically, I could just put her in my vehicle, but the call won't let us do that. So, we'll... Uh, We'll go ahead and get CareFlight in here and uh, see if they can send in some rappel down and get her some help. Get her to the nearest hospital. She's probably real dehydrated. Especially after drinking all that alcohol. Okay, there they are. They're going to rappel down and take her. I'm going to go out here and greet one of the paramedics because. He might want to give me a nice little kiflum. Hey. Hey. Oh my God. <laughs> that's the, I think that's the first time I've ever heard him say hey. <laughs> Usually they say kiflum. Okay, so we'll let them uh, be on their way. We have a civilian requiring assistance. In Mount Chiliad, units respond code 2. Okay. We actually have a missing person like right next to us. Uh, the GPS signal was lost. And now we're trying to regain it again. Dispatch, show me at scene Mount Chiliad. Looking for lost person. Okay, so we're looking for this lost person. And I'm not seeing another GPS signal on this person, so... This is going to be another blind uh, luck type of call, I think. If we can find them. Usually we have a nice signal strength. But I'm um, not getting any kind of signal strength on this one, so it may be just... Oh, okay, I see someone laying down out here. Oh, looks like they're in distress. Okay, we're definitely going to call in an air ambulance. She we has been mauled. In Mount Chiliad. All units respond code 99. Yep, she's been mauled. We're on it. Yep, animal got a hold of her. Probably a mountain lion. She's saying that uh, animal attacked her. It all happened so fast. Okay, we got a care flight coming in right now. We're going to take her to the nearest hospital, to the nearest level one trauma. Okay, ma'am, just one moment. They're going to come down and get you. Okay, how's it going? No way! All right. They're letting me know that they can that I can leave. They're gonna go ahead and take care of her, and then I uh, hope she's gonna be all right. But that was definitely an animal attack that got a hold of her. Okay. All units, we are code four. No further units required. Okay. Hopefully she'll be all right. Okay, we got another missing person around the same area. Strange, they usually, uh, she's usually in different areas. And I don't know if I'm going to get another signal on this one or not. I may have to go into it blind again. Yeah, let's go back down this way.
got lucky the last few times that I, I can actually spot them. Usually that's really hard to spot, especially if they're in a bush or something. But uh, I don't know, I kind of like the, the non-signal strength sometimes. Makes it seem a little more realistic, you know? Let's just go ahead and do this. See if we can actually see somebody. Why am I talking so quiet? <laughs> I feel I feel like I'm playing Deer Hunter. <laughs> Y'all ever play that game? Leave a uh, comment down there below if y'all have ever played that game. Okay. Not really see anything down there. Did y'all see anything there? <laughs> I'm still asking you. Okay, this is the last known area that they were at. So let's see if we can get up here, maybe get to a higher altitude. So we can locate them up here. Ah, oh, there they are. Okay. And once again, we are in a search and rescue unit F 150 Raptor. And looks like uh, they might be a little bit wounded. Do you need help? Who the fuck are you is what she's saying. I was uh, here relaxing, had a few beers. Okay, well, excuse me for uh, being concerned about you. Your friends are concerned. So, uh, you have fun there, okay? All units, we are code four. No further units required. And remember, there's mountain lines out here, so uh, just saying they're hungry. And you make a nice, full, tasty meal. Okay, guys, we're going to go ahead and end our episode right here. I really appreciate you guys stopping by for the Park Ranger episode in a special division called Search and Rescue. I do appreciate you guys. And uh, come back again, and make sure you share the video. That's the only way I can get my channel to actually grow. Y'all take care, and we'll see you next time on the Benzo Effect channel.